we had been to Nicaragua and Haiti and were quite blown away by the extreme poverty there, especially in Haiti, we were also extremely frustrated with the fact that nothing seemed to be working and global poverty stats are unbelievable and yet nothing seemed to be helping. I think the big thing today is, as we're seeing around the world, is that preventative health care is really the thing that people have to look at. That's basically what we try to do is create food and health security. Try for Good teaches sustainable life gardens and at least 63% of the gardens that we have started are now sustainable. It really represents something that becomes this challenge, this mountaintop, and it really requires almost a supernatural strength to, to be able to climb it for a lot of people. And so I see it as this thing of just saying, no, we, we think that there are big, big challenges in our lives, but all we gotta do is take one step. And this idea of impacting a thousand villages, it starts with the first step. I think when they see the founder of, of Thrive for Good out there and climbing that mountain, they're gonna be inspired and hopefully they're gonna wanna give. So the more money that Thrive for Good can bring in, the more people we can reach and help. Yeah, 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 yeah,